everyone. I won't be there today, but I wanted to let you know exactly what you are going to be doing in class today. So your teacher is going to hand out some handouts to you that goes over cause and effect, the stuff that we've been talking about for the past week and a half, about what causes another thing to happen. And so on this cause and effect vocabulary sheet, I want you to focus specifically on the words that let us know that it's a cause and effect relationship. So for example, like because, because of, as a result of, and so on. And this is the worksheet you're going to be handed today. And if you look here on the first sentence, I put effect and cause underneath the parts of the sentence that were effect and cause. And then I also put a box around the word that lets me know that it's a cause and effect relationship. You guys are gonna write your own sentences that do the same thing. You're going to put cause under the cause, effect under the effect, and then you're gonna put a box around the word or words that let you know that those things are related. And on the second page of it, I give you, uh, is that eight, hopefully? <laughs> eh, whatever, six spaces. Six spaces, so I want you to write your own sentences, do those same things, identify the cause, identify the effect, and then put a box around the word or words that lets you know that it is a cause and effect relationship. And on the other side, I want you to draw the cause and effect relationship. You can do it about whatever you want, as long as it's school appropriate. Yeah, I'm looking at you. Okay, now, for my art classes, I want you to work on drawing cylindrical objects. So think about maybe a, a cup, a Seahawks cup in my case or a tube of chapstick, or something like that. I want you to draw something cylindrical, something that is round and, and tall. So that's what you're gonna be doing for my art class. My science classes I just went over, and remember, I'll be back next week, and if I get a bad note from the sub, you're all not gonna be happy. So, I will see you on Monday. Have a good weekend, be good, be safe. Bye-bye.